hey everyone welcome back to crown geek in this video i will be explaining that how to reset windows 11 password without any software and if you have forgot your password and you do not know that how to recover it then do not need to worry so i will be also explaining that how you can change your password if you know your current password and if you are already on your computer screen so let's say you want to change your password and you know the current password then you have to right click on the windows icon then choose settings now from the left in menu option click on accounts then scroll down a bit and choose sign in option here click on password and then you can click on change now here you have to type your current password and then click on next and after that you have to type your new password and then rename or uh, retype your new password and that way you can easily change your password but what if you do not remember if you have forgotten your password and you are stuck on your login screen like this and you don't remember your password to log into your account so what you have to do just press and hold the shift key from your keyboard and while holding you have to click on this power icon at the right hand bottom and choose restart make sure that you do not leave the shift key while holding only you have to press restart and then restart anyway and keep holding until this screen goes away and now you can leave the shift key so now it will be loading up and you will be getting a kind of a blue screen that says choose an option like this now here you have to go with troubleshoot click on troubleshoot then click on advanced option and then click on command prompt now in case if it asks you the password or bit locker something like that in that case i will leave the link in the description you can watch that video but if you get this command prompt box then follow my instructions so first of all you have to type here disk part so we will be running this command to know that where exactly our operating system has been installed hit enter and then you have to type another command that will be list disk that will show us that how many disk drive we have then type list vol and hit enter so this will show that how many drive we have inside this disk and here you have to look for the one that is ntfs and have the maximum space so in my end it says volume one that is c drive which is ntfs and that is the maximum size 79 gigabyte and this is the only drive that contains the operating system all right so what we will do now we will exit from here then type another command that is c colon and hit enter then type cd space windows space forward slash system 32 hit enter and now we have to rename two file utilman.exe and cmd so we have to rename it so follow my command first command will be ren utilman.exe space utilman1.exe hit enter then you have to type another command that will be copy cmd.exe space utilman.exe hit enter once you are done then you can exit from here just type exit and then hit enter now again you will come to this blue screen now you have to click on continue and this will again take you to the login screen so where we have to follow the next step all right so now we are on the login screen so now what you have to do at the right hand corner you will see this accessibility option click on it and as soon as you click on it the black window will be coming up now in case if it doesn't come up and you keep clicking on it nothing happened then you have to restart your pc and then again you have to click on it and this command this box will be coming up all right so here you have to type a command that is control user passwords number two and hit enter and you will be getting the box of user account 
Now once this box comes up, you will see all kind of username here. So for whichever you want to change, click on it and then click on reset password. Now here you can just choose your password, whatever you want to type. So let's say if I want one, two, three, four, five, then I have to confirm it one, two, three, four, five, then click OK and OK again. So now the work is not finished because the password has been changed. We can now log into the computer, but still the file that we renamed, we have to revert that action because those files can infect your security. All right. So what you have to do next, close this box again, press the shift key and while holding it, click on this power icon and choose restart. Click restart anyway. And again, the screen will be coming up with a blue screen to say choose an option. So once this blue screen comes up, you have to click on troubleshoot. Then click on advanced option and then on command prompt. Now here you have to type command that is C colon enter cd space windows space forward slash system 32 enter and then you have del space util man dot exe and then we have to rename the file that we renamed as uh, one so you have to type ren util man one dot exe and this we will revert to util man dot exe hit enter and then you have to type another command ren util man dot exe space cmd dot exe once you are done you can just close it or you can just type exit to exit it out then click on continue so now once you are on the login screen you have to type the same password that you changed one two three four five and you will be logged into your computer so that's all guys hopefully this video will help you to quickly reset your password on windows 11 without any software and still if you have any issues any problem any doubt let me know in the comment section and if this worked for you then please consider subscribing to the channel like the video and i will see you later thank you so much bye bye